So here I am in this Plaza Gala in Brussels, October 5, 2012. And um, yeah, have a bit of a look at it. Yeah, it's cool. Well, I used to live here. I didn't know how it was, what it was called. Uh, and uh, well, now I know the unofficial name, as I said in the previous vlog. And um, I have to do a lot of thinking in the next uh, day or two about um, what's my marketing strategy and my strategy in general um, for uh, re-entering EU affairs in Brussels after so many years. And obviously my Twitter activity, although some people say, what, Twitter? Who cares if you have 2,500 followers on Twitter? Well, I don't like these who are followers, but people who follow you. Yeah, you see my cane. Um, that's a temporary thing, but I think I'm actually going to use it as part of my marketing or identity, uh, curving my identity thingy. Um, and, um, and this as well, as long as, you know, the neck brace, as long as I have to wear it. This is a... And the humidity also is a bit of a concern of mine, but uh, if I still just have to address it in a flexible way. Um, I just took two taxis to go from Centreville to, um, to the Quartier Européen. It cost me 10 euros going and 10 euros coming. That's 20 euros. That's probably double, even more than double that I would pay for an equivalent distance in Athens. So I have to factor that cost in. I also looked in a couple of apartments and big building blocks over there, near Square Aburix, or what is it, Mary Louise? I can't remember the time, yeah. it's been a long time. Um, but I was tired, and uh, actually there's lots of humidity here, right now, than it was like 20 minutes ago in um, in Square Aburix. So, hum Brussels humidity is still a kind of like mystery to me, and you know me, I'm an analytical kind of guy, and it's fact searching, so I'm going to try to find the ins and outs and systemics of this issue because that's the way I am a geek no sense denying